Hey guys, welcome to my channel, Crystal XOXO. Thank you, thank you for coming and joining with me. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I'm like, can't even talk today. Ah, happy Labor Day weekend, as you can say. If you hear that loud noise, it's the train. It's a freight train. Um, yeah, don't forget to put your notification bell. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Uh, what we're going to talk about um, is Candyman. Everyone's been talking about Candyman. And um, it debuted last week. And I've been hearing everybody talking about it. So yesterday I went to Studio Grill. I went to go see Candyman 2021. But before that, I had to see the original because you know, you forget the movie, the original, the 1992. So, I watched the new, the 1992. You can rent it on YouTube for like $3.99. Or you can watch it for free, Tubi. But there's some ads in it. I do not have it on DVD. I'm surprised I don't own it on DVD. I watched Candyman when it came out in 1992 as a kid. I was like 12 years old. Life goes so fast. Where does time go? And uh, oh yeah, I'm drinking some Starbucks. Gotta have my coffee. Gotta have my coffee. So I had to watch the original. And you know, the original is always a classic. You know, just it's just a classic. You know, you got the film in Chicago. They filmed it in 1992. They're filming in green and greens, the ghetto, the hood. It can't get more ghetto than that. It's a black neighborhood. And the myth is like, never say candy man. Not one, not two, not three, but five times in the mirror. Oh my God, when I was a kid in theater, I got so like, oh my God, what I just saw. I think, I, yeah, I went with, um, with my family members. It was my aunt. That's when I saw the movie. And um, it was scary. It was good. Then later on, it was on DVD, Black Buck Video Store. Who remembers that? And um, I rented it, you know? I had never thought 20 years plus, 25 years later, they would make a new one, 2021. I was like, what? Everyone's talking about it. I hope it's really good. Like the original, because the original is amazing. And all these trains, I'm filming right by the train. Well, I'm like, right where I'm at. So the original, I'm like, I'm, I'm like, dang, I saw the trailer. It looked dark. Like a beginning, of, middle of August. I'm like, man, this looks good. But it's like, who's directing? Who's the actors? for the 2021 uh, for Candyman. When you watch a new and a, a remake of original, always go back, watch the original before you jump into a newer movie, a remake. Because you always gotta go back to a remake. You always gotta go back to the original. And sometimes when the remake, it can go a flop too, you know, a pen. Depends on the director and depends on the actor. I got this little good chicken sandwich. Alright, I might have lunch with you guys. So, um, so anyways, I go to Studio Grill. Before I, before I hit Studio Grill, I watched Chainsaw Massacre. Uh, totally the, the, the 70s. Classic. I've been watching a lot of scary fall movies. It is September. Happy Labor Day weekend, guys. Look at this yummy, like, chicken sandwich. So, I go, I get my ticket. And Studio Grill, you can sit down. And eat. So I have Buffalo Wild with Buffalo boneless wings and a big glass of ice water. 
I'm so excited. I gave my seat. I was all stoked, ready to see the movie. And honestly, go see it. I give it a 10. That movie is so lit. So, it's crazy. Little Anthony, the baby, grows up as an adult. So, it's good. Go see it. I, I give it a 10, honestly. Candyman 2021 is good. Um, there's no worse to it. <laughs> I liked how they filmed it in Chicago. Kareem Greens is broken down in the hood, but they did show some parts of the hood in Chicago. Um, they took it back from like, it was like the new and the old and the 2021. Um, no words. Definitely I would buy that on DVD or buy it on streaming when it comes available. I paid 11 bucks to watch it. It was worth it. I had a good time. It was an hour and something minutes. It was good. Um, it was good. I, I just, there's no words to it. Um, the new and the old defined. I like both of them. Um, there's no words for both. Like, I, my opinion, they're both good, honestly. The director that did 2021, I thought it was going to go like a flap, but nah, it was good. The actors were good. Um, it was scary and dark, the new one. And so, and it brought back like the original character, like Helen. And they talk about Brenda and the old one. And they talk Anthony, the baby. It, it brought what the new and the old mix in the 2021. So go check that movie out, honestly. If you like scary movies, like I like scary movies, um, I recommend watch the original before you watch the new one. So you can remember what you saw, cause that movie is old. I'm super excited for the new Halloween. I guess Halloween Kills. Oh, that's gonna be cool. I don't know who's directing that, but like, how many times Michael Myers can die, right? So yeah. All right, guys. Um, I'm about to end my um, video pretty soon. And um, there's going to be a lot of new scary movies coming out, lining up for September, October. So check it out on social media or check it out on YouTube. They always got new trailers. This anime is really good. I'm gonna tell you one thing. When I watched Candyman, the old and the new, I saw like the old Chicago, how it looked like. And then I got to see the new, what 2021, what Chicago looks like. So when I saw that movie, I was 12. Now I'm like old. I know I look good for my age, but it's like it changed so much Chicago. It changed a lot. So yeah, they always film a lot of movies here in Chicago, Illinois. All right, guys. You guys have a great, amazing day. Hope everyone have a good, positive day. And I see you next time in my next video on YouTube. But adios. See you later. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Chris on Ice. Don't forget to leave your notification bell. All right. See you later in my next video. Bye.